my husband doesn't like def being defensive. When I, when I got married to him, I was I, I used to feel I'm small. So he would mm -hmm. take advantage of me. <laughs> Nowadays I've grown up, I'm at least big. Four kids. <laughs> now, I was yes. that defensive mm -hmm. mom. And I was also getting mm -hmm. hard time saying sorry. If mm -hmm. I have to say sorry, I have to say it in form of action. Nikuangeze mboga. Nikuangeze mboga. Or I just become nice. Yeah. So, I realized it's not actually helping. Kuna siku alinuliza kitu. Isabel. So much i know you are really following this show and you are enjoying mm. benefits what can bring couples together mm -hmm. hugging mm -hmm. 15 Look. minutes mm. <laughs> looking in the eye 20 yes. minutes yes. kissing 11 minutes we are not for six minutes now and you said something so powerful that about uh, about i'm going to see at the end of 24 hours how many hours do we need as a couple but i don't know yes I was there's a there's a there's a calculator i'm adding so uh there's something you said so powerful yes. about sending kids yes. and i think in a house you've not been doing that but you'll be doing it indirectly yes so what we do we yes. always have our family fellowships in the evening uh -huh. so maybe that's why you can say uh, dad is a very good guy. he's a very hard working father for us i know he loves us then to nasema ile juju to i love yeah i also say uh, i love mom nini juju but i think this thing mm, of you don't say you love mom let me just say <laughs> my husband never says it's not easy for him to say he loves you she but always, he will do something that makes the kids say it. the kids will say daddy and appenda mom wow. okay small small things like maybe helping me with the shoes wow. daddy helping me like when I, I feel sick when i had delivered he's just there with me wow. brushing my face but he will never tell you i love you yeah. He will do anything, buy you chocolates, bring, mm -hmm. so I understand it's, it's I, I not, it's not I, I, much yeah, of the what word. Is, what you're saying is very true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For us in our home, yes. I could never, I've never even called my father to dad or mom, mom. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. there was not the, that, that in gap. the family. At, 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 daddy, no. yeah. tu, yeah. So that so that gap, <laughs> me I know I love her. I can write to her. Yeah. I can say it yeah. once in a while, but mostly I do it through actions. Mm. So <clears throat> I cannot say before. It will kids, help with my makeup, my mm, hair, or I'll, something. I'll, I'll, I'll come and put her nails yeah, on. Yeah, wow. uh, 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 But it is good. I, I'll do them. But now <laughs> saying it, I. I Struggle, but that doesn't mean that I don't yeah. love. Yeah, but I, me, I, say I understand uh, because I think it's a problem with the, with the African men. Mm. They never, you see, we have said children mm. learn by what they see and hear, mm. learn by what they see and, and hear. hear. Yeah. So if you never saw, man, you can see. You never man saw. Can do. Man can do what? Saw. Ne, man can never saw. So the man will not the do. Man can't do. But now these forums are very important, and such teachings are very important mm. yes. because now we need to undo. Mm. Even if we never learned because our parents also had not learned, mm. yeah. now that knowledge has come, mm. we try to undo these things by practicing small, small. Yes. We may not begin at a very high level. Why? Mm. The 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 way to the heart of your wife mm. is through her ear. Yeah. Mm. So women are more inclined to something that they they are spoken they are to hearing. they are mm -hmm. hearing so even if you you are not trained you never saw that it's not in your mind mm -hmm. you you deliberately intentionally mm -hmm. you know keep on telling her that my wife i'm doing all this because i love you mm -hmm. you're very important in my life mm -hmm. so it's something that we all should learn mm -hmm. even we mm -hmm. we should also learn mm -hmm. to, to, to speak men should learn to speak to their wives mm -hmm. and also vice versa exactly. and that's why now our children are coming in because we want to correct the error mm -hmm. and the mistake that was yeah. done by yeah. our parents yeah. so we want to correct it with our children mm. by telling them that you can share love mm. you can talk about love mm. openly to someone whom you feel mm -hmm. you care mm -hmm. and someone you feel that you want to share life with mm -hmm. so these are things that our children now have even a better marriage than what we have yes. if we put these things into practice because when they are fixed in their mind it will be fixed in their lives wow. so i agree yeah, with and you, you know, what you're saying there are small <clears throat> activities that every family can decide mm. I, I think we can do this and yes you just choose what works for you Yes, Pastor. Uh, I mean, you can just call your son one morning and mm -hmm. tell him, My son, can you come? We make the bed together. You are training them mm -hmm. how to make the bed. One morning, you can tell them, Let's My daughter, cook. can you come? We cook together. Wow. We, we fry Mom's the eggs. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You are training that child. Mm -hmm. Maybe I've got chickens. 
All right? Mm. Can we go and collect the eggs together mm. today? Mm. Uh, if it's only mommy who has been doing that, yeah. you are training yeah. that yeah. child. Yeah. That's, that's yeah. what we have in our mind. That you know, we have in our mind. Because that's what we saw. Exactly. Like, Jigonia yeah, is for women. Oh, exactly. yeah, cooking is for women. Exactly. Meaning for women. Exactly. So when we incorporate no. them, they are able to know that yes. anyone can do anything. That, yeah. You could mm. be having even mothers who don't have mm. you know, their husbands mm. or their windows. Mm. Be the first one. Because anything children exactly. are taught by the parents mm. they are very proud of mm. you feel you really want to associate that with your father mm. with your mother so that's very very important mm. and you know and that's then, very important mm. because what you teach your children those was God's memories for them mm. they will not wow. forget that mm. that's anything you do for your child mm. that's very important to check what you do well you know all the to around 18 years mm. uh, okay it's, it's very very to check what what you are doing mm. because anything that you do for them they will not forget. They will never forget. They will always remember the visits that you went in the school, mm. the meetings mm. that you attended, the words you told. You know, you the time you took them to the hospital. Mm. You know, mommy was supposed to go, but you said, "Ah, uh ah, -uh, I'm the one who's taking you to the hospital." Mm. Uh, now that we're talking about what mm. the kids are seeing in our yeah. home is what they will replicate mm. outside there yeah. when they grow up. Mm. Uh, that you are saying couples should uh, create mm. an environment of nurturing love mm. openly. Yes. Mm. Maybe we can also encourage because also it has been an issue mm. that most men find it hard mm. even if they take their wives mm. to the restaurant mm. just pulling a chair mm. they feel like they are feeling it's so much of a burden yeah. yes. or maybe mm. you have a car yeah. but kila mtu ajiendange ufunguange ukiingia so you see those things we were never taught and men were never taught mm -hmm. and i think it should actually be some I are doing agree. them mm. some are not doing i agree with you very i want to say something mm. Mm. what very has just said mm. has something to do with a woman in the evening mm. Just opening the door mm. for her, giving her a seat. Mm. We, see, we were talking about the tua tua. Yeah. It has something in a woman's exactly. mind, emotions, mm. about how the tua tua shall be. Mm. You, you, you are making, you are warming her up, mm. warming her up. So mm. when it comes to the act of sex, she'll be so, so much yielding. Mm. Yeah. Unlike you never opened the door, you never alikuwa na mtoto wa meshika, so she has to tell the other, the son, <laughs> so it, it, it has also all yeah. these things, you, they end up, mm. the bed suffering mm -hmm. because there's something that was not done you know that kind action mm -hmm. that kind action that kind word mm -hmm. is very important in, in couples that thing yeah that's mm -hmm. very true and yes. i think it's something we need to do because they say that most of them we don't tell kids what to do mm -hmm. just then they'll copy wow and that thing you were saying about uh, that they don't forget yes i think i made them a cake when was it Kitabo, 20, like 20, four years 2018 ago. Yeah. They wrote I, ma composition. I made a cake mm -hmm. one day mm -hmm. until now that don't like now Wow. Wow. I, was, I was reading the composition. They, they, they wrote the, the teacher, my dad makes very nice cake. Mm -hmm. He's a funny man. Mm -hmm. He's a chef. And I was like, your daddy doesn't cook I'm not much. a chef. Yeah. That was in 2010 when I made a cake for them. Yeah. He so loves mommy. He loves and there was you. They're talking about the cake I made them. They don't forget. They don't so forget. what you're saying is very true. Yeah. And you know what? Yeah. Uh, like the other day, I remember we were getting rich. Mm. to go to was it church or where we were going mm. and the kids were like daddy why, why are we getting rid why can't we leave mom and we just go you know mm. they were like eh, we are so getting we rid dad we are living at the eight mm. exactly and mom has not left the house exactly uh -huh. and, and and you know what i told them mm. um, one thing i want you to understand eh? mm. you are neighbors in this home <laughs> <laughs> Your neighbors, <laughs> all right. Yeah. Uh, by that is true. Your children are neighbors. Mm. One day they will go. Mm -hmm. One time we used to be with our parents. We are no longer with them. Yeah. Mm. Sure. You get it. Mm. Eh? So I told them mm. the most important person in this home. Mm. It is not first born, second born, or third born. Mm. The most important person is your mother. That's very true. I can leave all of you, <laughs> but I can't leave her. Mm. That was a Watch out to you get it, eh? I was teaching them how to handle their wives when they get married. Mm. Wow. Because we Without you know, yes. you know what? 
Because men, because women like will, will somehow yes. delay yes. to yes. get out of the house. Mm -hmm. They want to leave the, the yes. room clean. Yes. They want to leave whatever. There's something she has yes. forgotten. Her exactly. makeup, she goes yeah. back again. Exactly. So you find as you're waiting for your wife with your children yeah. in the mm -hmm. car, you're likely to, to take more time as she's clearing up. Mm -hmm. But the children feel, no, see, we have two cars. Sisi wacha tuwe tunaenda, mama tatufuata. But you see now, you corrected that. So mm -hmm. in the evening, when in the afternoon, when you were going home, mm -hmm. they told me, what? Mom, si tulijaribu kuambia dad, ati tukuwache, mm -hmm. atuwe utakuja na iyo gari ingine. Mm -hmm. Aka tuambia, afadhali ya tuwache. <laughs> afadhali ya tuwache, yes. akubebe wewe. Yes. Ati hakuna mtu wa maana maisha yake kama ye. Mm -hmm. hey, na mom si unapendo. Mm -hmm. You see to them now, <laughs> he has already preached a sermon to them. Yeah, yeah. Yes, and yeah. then he told us, mm -hmm. then my son, my, my son said, first of all, they said, I, but dad also taught us something. Mm -hmm. That women will, when we marry, mm -hmm. that women will, will take longer to do something, mm -hmm. prepare, mm -hmm. you know, or do all things. Mm -hmm will delay you yeah. so dad taught us that we have to be patient yeah. when we marry we need to be patient with our wives mm -hmm. but you see wow. how would have that lesson wow. got it be very practical mm -hmm. until when until it happened until it happened yeah. to their own mother mm -hmm. so that was very very important and from that time you find even when I delay they, they are not agitated they are not upset mm -hmm. they have that patience to wait on me mm -hmm. why because the father taught them you, you, you may think that you are outside the topic yes. no <laughs> it was about how sex is getting lost in marriage Yes. Imagine if your wife hears that you're ready for those hours. Yeah. Yeah. So, next, next point on the same. Thing that is very important. Yes. We should be our fifth day mm. on connecting mm. emotionally mm. so that you can also connect in tour tour. Wow. Because the question was about, you know, mm. uh, we don't connect. We yeah. don't connect. That's why sexual yeah. is getting out of marriage. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Yeah. It's very important to ask your wife, your husband. Yes. Mm. Give me a summary mm. of how you spent your day. Wow. wow. Give me a summary. Would you, of would you give me a summary? Yes. 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 So, so, she, she, she's always very good at asking that question. Mm -hmm. Me always say, it's equal to power. And she, she like, me like, I say, me answer kusama suguinili and I even. I always say, I know how was your day? It was fine. Then I'm here. How was it? I'm here. Since she can't be the poor poor, so I'm like, I'm talking about being in. For me, the day was good. Details. 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 Yeah. Or maybe create a conversation around. Or create a conversation around. Yeah. Like, how are you doing today? I met our old school friend. Something like that. Yeah. We're working on some deal with it. Mm -hmm. One Later. of your buddies, yeah, I know he yeah. has one buddy I can mention yes, yeah. here, yeah. plus mm -hmm. many others. Yeah. So my husband has been struggling with, the, I'm more of a, mm. a communicator mm. because yes. I'm a melancholy. Mm. Yes. I really think of my words before, but my husband, mm. if he has something, he will just go quiet. Yes. Or he will give you a one word answer. So I mm. probe him. So Mamuni, I think Leo. That's why I love you. <laughs> That's why I love you because if you are both melancholies, uh -huh. we'll ah, be having so many be. words. Yes. Yeah, but me, I'm like that. Yes. I talk. Even when my husband is a yeah. melancholy yeah. Yeah. and an introvert. Mm -hmm. As we are extroverts, yeah, so yeah, yeah. and at a ungea kwa ivo too. Yes. But since I le kuunge le iko organized, we have this. We have to talk about mm -hmm. it deeply. Yes. Or maybe you have certain issue. We have to talk about it. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, your challenge. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. So but that's nowadays, why you, nowadays you are a very. Try. You are a very smart. In fact, fan. when she wants to talk to me, I, I put my phone yeah. aside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Excellent. God bless you. God bless you for that. Yes. He's yes. a great listener. Wow. I, I wanted to talk about how, mm -hmm. how uh, you have said how was a, a summary. summary. Yeah, a summary. What, mm -hmm. what do we mean when we talk about a summary? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It doesn't mean that you have not been together. Mm -hmm. You would be when the husband left in mm -hmm. the morning mm -hmm. or the wife left and went to job. Mm -hmm. uh, so you have a lot to share. Mm -hmm. But you could also have spent the whole day together because mm -hmm. that does yeah, not mean yeah, that because yeah. you spend the day together, you're not supposed to talk. Mm -hmm. No. You should talk. You could be having your own experiences. For example, mm -hmm. most of the times when we are going for meetings, mm -hmm. couples meetings, mm -hmm. we are going for corporate meetings where mm -hmm. we have been invited. Mm -hmm. uh, most of the times I find myself just taking a nap mm -hmm. because my husband is a very good driver mm -hmm. so and uh, i sleep i can sleep maybe we are going to nakuru mm -hmm. we are going to meru mm -hmm. we are going to kisi we are going to mombasa mm -hmm. so you find on the on the way mm -hmm. have slept mm -hmm. and maybe probably there are things that he encountered you see the same thing <laughs> when you are driving <laughs> kuna so I'm Maybe I woke up and thought maybe it was a bump. Mm -hmm. But Kumbe, it's God who has just delivered mm -hmm. us from an accident. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it could be also the 
is a phone he received. Mm -hmm. uh, all that. So, mm -hmm. summary does not mean mm -hmm. that you need to give summary just because you've been away physically. Mm -hmm. no. yeah, yeah, that's something that most couples now must correct that. Mm -hmm. Summary, every day giving summary to the emotional womb. Mm -hmm. How many minutes? Yeah, it means. <laughs> That one, let it flow. Let it just let flow. It just flow. Yeah. Yeah. The Number next six. question yeah. is, mm. you need to ask your partner, uh, uh, I don't know how you, depending with how you call yourself, you maybe others call darling, others say my dear, yeah. others say babe. Mm. Babe, do you have something that you wanted to share with me? Wow. Because summary and sharing is very different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I wanted to share with you something because I have noted uh, you are very rude to me. Mm. Anytime I ask you wow. something, even in the presence of the children, mm. I've been observing mm. you're becoming rude. Mm. And I'm wondering, is it that you have, have offended you? Mm -hmm. Is there something that you're not comfortable with? Because this now has not happened even the first, the second, and you're able to sort it out. Mm. And then the wow. wife is able to tell you, yeah, you mean, I, yeah, for the last three months, actually my wife and my husband mm. have just been Na, I, I've be just been observing you and I feel no, this is not the same soon. Mm -hmm. This is not the same one. Mm -hmm. I can also ask him about toa toa. Mm -hmm. I can also tell him, I think, when we go to have sex, within one minute you have come. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm wondering, what mm -hmm. could be? Is it that you are stressed? Is it that uh, you could be developing maybe diabetes or hypertension yeah. that we need to be checked on? Mm -hmm. Could there be anything? Mm -hmm. You get that? Wow. That reassures your partner. Mm -hmm. You know, some things it could be, you are coming very late. That's mm -hmm. something I wanted to tell you. Mm -hmm. And the children are asking me, they only see dad over the weekend. Mm -hmm. Weekday, dad and Akuja very late. In the mm -hmm. morning when they want to say hi to him, he's asleep. Mm -hmm. or, or, or a shy talker. Mm -hmm. So the children are telling me, if it's possible, atakama unasema uko very busy at the place of work, mm -hmm. would you find like two days or three days to come early for the sake of the mm -hmm. children? Mm -hmm. Even for my sake. You see that sharing something. Yeah. Now you're creating a safe space for the partner to open up. Oh yes. Because mostly men are always uh, bottled up with issues. Yeah. Issues. Yes. Yeah. So and you see now this emotional womb is mm. hurting. Mm. And when it is hurting, mm. it will result for the the, 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 the the side effects will go to the toa mm -hmm. on the bed. That's why you find you're not you're not you're not able to you're connect. Mm. But it's because yeah. there's something that you have always wanted to tell your partner. Mm. But these people are so busy for you. Mm. So you keep wondering when will I share this? So you find a husband has so many to small small things wow. that he has never bottled up. Bot bot up. He has never told the wife and vice versa. Mm. So, but when you 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 are very deliberate, intentional every day to ask each other, do you have something that you want to share with me? Yeah. They'll be available they and they will and they open up. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, also, when you are told about your issue, like this, for example, he has noted that maybe I talk rudely. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't be on the defensive. Thank side. you. Mm -hmm. Big defensive cuts of communication. Because Thank you. For example, mm -hmm. if he's a person who doesn't open up much mm -hmm. and he has gathered that energy just to share with oh, you yes, that my wife you've been mm -hmm. hurting me how you talk to me mm -hmm. and when he tells me that and then I, I get so defensive mm -hmm. I cut him even before I onge, mm -hmm. that and then, guy will never talk to you and then again you, you, you accuse something that happened many years ago yeah you bring you back bring it today Mm. That mm. is so unfair. That's very unfair. Yeah. And you see now, that daily asking each other, do you have something that you want to share with me, mm. avoids you get, remaining with bitterness, with yeah. anger. Mm. Yeah? yeah. Because now you have made sure that the sun has not set mm. before you have sorted out your mm. issues. issues. Because issues in marriage, anything can become a cause of conflict mm. in marriage. Exactly. So when you learn to share on a daily basis mm. and become intentional, this does not just come automatically mm. you guys have to be very intentional wow. that you have to and they can ask mm -hmm. and if you find your partner has forgotten ask them mm -hmm. you get that that sharing it, it makes your emotional womb mm -hmm. to connect very easily because mm -hmm. when the emotional womb is very very intact mm -hmm. there they, they can never be separation mm -hmm. they can never be divorce mm -hmm. they can never be pain they can never be bitterness mm -hmm. and then it, it is in that asking sharing with you that you talk about something that you offended mm -hmm. and you, you forgive each other mm -hmm. and you move on and I like the way Pastor Munene says that in a couple, a couple has to be very intentional. Mm -hmm. When your partner corrects you over something, mm -hmm. don't make it as a, as a, a case. Yeah. Mm -hmm. kama ni kesi. Exactly. You know, mm -hmm. you are defending mm -hmm. it and you really want to win mm -hmm. the argument. No, because he keeps saying, even if I win mm -hmm. in that argument, mm -hmm. nitapeleka Pastor Munene njela gani? Kuna. Ala fata, Nisawa you don't, nime win. You win. Then, then, yeah. Yeah. then, then, then pia tukisha win argument, hakuna nga certificate unapewa. Thank you, hakuna certificate. <laughs> mm. There is something that my husband has taught mm. me over the years, yes. because we've been there for 
14 years, darling. Mm -hmm. God has been gracious to ah, us. Mm -hmm. My husband doesn't like de being defensive. When I, when I got married to him, I, was, I, I used to feel I'm small. So he would mm -hmm. take advantage of me. <laughs> Nowadays I've grown up, I'm at least big. Four kids. <laughs> now, I was yes. that defensive mm -hmm. mom. Mm -hmm. And I was also getting time, mm -hmm. hard time saying sorry. If mm -hmm. I have to say sorry, I have to say it in form of action. Nikuangeze mboga. Nikuangeze mboga. Or I just become nice. <laughs> yeah. So, I realized it's not actually helpful. I could have seen when Uliza Kitu is a very wise man. Yeah. Okay. So, you want to win this argument. Niache basi will win. I'm like, I'm like, I was like, okay. I'm, I'm defending so much. Mm -hmm. I went and sat myself down. Wow. You have just to be mm -hmm. somebody who can be approachable. So my husband, when he talks to me nowadays, I listen. And say, if you are ready to listen, we talk. I listen. Wow. He talks, and if there is an area, I'm, I'm, have, have I improved? Very much. Very nowadays, much. I say Very sorry. Much. I don't feel like he's taking something from me when I say wow. sorry. Mm. And then when he tells me, here, I don't like I say, honey, I'm sorry. Mm. It, it was a mess up. I'm yeah. going to work on it, Excellent. and it, it won't mm. happen again. And then mm. uh, sometimes also, mm. when there's an issue, yes. Mm. She was she lazima to mal the size. Yeah. We have to tackle it. And like maybe that, that time temperatures are so high. Mm -hmm. Me, I feel like no. Let us come down, we'll talk that come here, we have to talk. Yeah. We have to talk. Do we talk in this environment? And then I would use She'll this say, verse. Mm -hmm. I would say the Bible says people should not go to bed with, with what? Without settling issues. Mm -hmm. And also God says that before we go to him, we have to go back to our brethren and mm -hmm. settle scores. So we are settling scores. And it must be now. And for me, like in that mood, I cannot talk anything. Oh, yes. I'll not solve anything. I would like maybe I go and sit just under a tree. When I'll come back, I'll talk so well. Wonderful. Or I go and watch a movie or listen to a song. Wow. I'll come and talk. But for now, nowadays she understands. Can we talk later? Mm. Yes, so, okay, but make it faster. I think, then I think she'll give me time. Then she'll come back and now say, it's, Can it's we now a, talk? I say, it's mm, also give a me five journey, minutes. Yeah. A journey of emotional maturity. Wow. I wasn't emotionally Thank mature you. when I was grown. Mm. Uh, he married me at 24. At 20, 21. 21, no, no, he was 24. Wow. Yes, wow. so it has been a journey. Mm. Emotionally, people, I think there are stages of growth wow, emotionally. It's very true. So I've taken deliberately I've studied books on mm. just emotional intelligence mm. to understand my husband, his love wow. language and various aspects of myself. Mm -hmm. Because if you are not self aware, you mm. can never understand your You partner. can never understand mm. yourself and yeah. so you cannot understand the other person. Yeah. So, so I mm. think we should talk about just communication of these days. Communication yes. marriage. How mm. to tackle your communication yeah. about how mm. was your day, how do we mm -hmm. approach an issue for yes. humanness it'll be a topic on its own. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Yeah, so we are just talking mm. now mm. How to make this emotional womb healthy? Yes. Yeah. healthy. yes. Uh, how to feed another the emotional womb. Yes. Another thing uh -huh. that you need to do on a daily basis. Those are things that you must do on a daily basis. Now number what? I think seven. number seven. Number seven. Number seven. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then number seven. Now mm -hmm. make sure that you shower together. Yes. yes. There is a place we went to uh -huh. yes. <laughs> <laughs> When you put it, the person, it's already full. So he said, it's a little bit smiling. My husband is a dog, so he's big. Even at the end, he's a big guy. He's a big guy. He said, it's a big guy. This place. And then we moved to a house, we got a bigger bedroom. Even we do most of our tour towards there in the morning. Yes. Yeah, in the in the bathroom. Yeah, bathroom. that's very important. Because when we wake up, we wake up, we do meditations, prayers, yes, workouts, and then when we go bathing together, yes, and it's so easy. it's so nice. Awesome. Yeah, awesome. it might not be all the time, but mm. make it a once deliberate in a while. Yeah. once in a while. Mm. Just get into the shower. Muna muna subuana uko nyuma mari viki. You know muna muna jaribu style zingine uko. It brings such an an atmosphere. Yeah. And at the end of the day, you are feeling in your emotional yeah. um yeah. that yeah. makes you console. I, I, Bishop was saying that when a wife is still new, would say Kama Mejifuno Sukwa and Akufonika, Kamu Kokobafu, and Akambi and Kusadi Kuva in Kona, if he is at Batimushansa Kasana Manza Kuzeka, yes, and Akambi Kilam to Japan and Gungoyak. But I thought. 
out it should be something that you should not be fading with the time. Yeah. In fact, you could suggest any and later. In fact, the more we get Even old, the, old the harder it gets to reach. The woman said, "Could the person not be a nice idea?" Yes. Yeah, I think. But we think together. Yes. You keep it on a it's very, very, very important mm. to shower it's together when you are naked. Yes. You are naked and you are not ashamed. Yes. Naked, oh, yeah. naked and not That's ashamed. Sure. Yeah, because now uh -huh. you are able to connect emotionally. Mm -hmm. Another thing that we are supposed to do on a daily basis, which mm -hmm. is very, 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 also very important, mm -hmm. is to make sure that uh, uh, we, we, you keep on, um, what would I say, uh, you can have a dance. Something you like doing together. Something that you like doing together. Uh -huh. you, enjoy doing. you feel that emotional womb. Mm -hmm. You can have a dance. You can have a you dance. You can do exercises together. You can do exercises mm -hmm. together. You know. For us, we tried dancing, but my all my legs are left, so I fell down. <laughs> so and, her, and for her, she loves dancing so much. I told you we join salsa. So, but, but, but at least it's slow. But it's now at, at least we found, I, 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 we we do watch a movie together. Yeah. We do, we can read a book together. Wow. That's what wow. we enjoy yeah. most. Yeah. Actually, we enjoy reading. We are mm. both big on reading. Mm -hmm. yeah. Reading mm -hmm. family, wow. family resources. Yes. So we, we create time deliberately for Swimming. That. Yeah. Uh, Swimming. Mm -hmm. And of course, <laughs> praying. You can even pray together. Is, yeah. Praying is, under praying is also the yeah. activity yeah. together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so I think uh, yeah. that's a very good point. Mm -hmm. And I think as we just coming to the end of this show, mm -hmm. I would like, before, uh, before we conclude, let's just each one of us to give the last views. Yes. And then we, we conclude. The reason why couples, um, their love will go down and they don't have to a tour. Mm. I would say the major reason is lack of knowledge. Mm. If anybody gives himself to knowledge, mm. let me tell you, no matter where you started, mm. no matter how low you are, you can go somewhere. By the way, do you know, we are marriage uh, mentors. We talk to so many people. Uh, either on one-on-one -on -one or online but I want to let you know something we also take time to attend seminars conference we sit down to be taught on how we can have a good family now if we are doing that yet we are talking to so many other people do you have time for your family to go for a couples meeting to go for a seminar I think if you want to have a good marriage, if you want to have good to a tour, create time to read books, attend meetings, so that your knowledge can grow and you go to the next level. Do you have mentors, people who talk to you? I and Pastor Sue, we have got people who talk to us. We visit them, not one, not two, to share about our relationship, about marriage. Who is your marriage mentor? You cannot set an exam and you give yourself the answers. You require a neutral person. Wow. Get mentors for your family. God wow. bless you. I just want to say something on what Pastor Monene has just said. We have to be very intentional, deliberate, and very conscious about our marriage working. I want to say this. There is a myth that people just think that marriage should just work from the blue. It is not true. You've got to put something in your emotional womb as we have just discussed to make sure that you stay connected forever. Just like God demands from us that we study his word, we pray, and we also go for fellowship. By so doing, you maintain your spiritual life. So is it. Just like in your business, your career, you have to present yourself. You have to daily go there so that you can see your business grow or your career, you know, thriving. So the same thing with marriage. It is not that it just happens that you have a good marriage. Both of you must be very intentional to make sure that this marriage works. And what are we saying? The challenge that we have with so many couples, we have too much knowledge, but the challenge is we don't want to put the knowledge that we have received into practice. And so it is not all up to God. God. Neither is it all up to you. It is there is a part for you to play as a, as a husband and as a wife. And you need to know that your marriage you must be convinced beyond any reasonable doubt that you are not ready for separation. You are not ready for divorce. You are not ready for hurting one another. You are ready to make things happen. And I want to say this: the first people that you are supposed to influence with your marriage is actually 
marry your son and your daughter. If you have not managed to make sure that your sons and your daughters enjoy marriage, then we have failed. I want to let you know that it is important for us to know we have to invest ourselves to each other and help one another to become the best version that we can be. What can I, what can I say? The capacity of every husband and wife it is the ability to stay together without causing much commotion to each other, but giving each other peace of mind and heart so that we can be able to live together the 80, the 90, the 100 years that God intended. I hope you're going to be a doer and apply this wisdom in your marriage. See you then. God bless you. What a show, guys. Wow. If you've been following our show from the last episode to today's, you must have learned a thing or two. One of the main things that came up is emotional connection. How to connect your partner emotionally. And they say nothing changes unless you change. You must first take that deliberate step as a person to make the change. Start by getting interested in your partner. I've learned a lot. If you do not know the name of the show, it's called Naked and Not Ashamed. Kindly continue to follow us on YouTube and all our social media platforms and subscribe to the show. For if you subscribe, we'll be able to reach many other families and who knows, maybe a home, a family will be saved by your support by this show. Thank you very much and continue to tune in to our show every Tuesday in the evening. Be blessed. Wow, we had a set of questions and we've only tackled one and being with these couples is always a season just to learn and I've learned so much. What I've learned and I'm going to pick today practically is using our children to be part of our love in our marriage. You see, most couples when they go through what you call nail by mouth, they use their children. <laughs> so I'm sending a message to my wife through my child. So I think we should now change that now to be positive messages going to our our children, our spouses, so that kids can know that this marriage is a beautiful one. And I want to thank you so much for these uh, questions, how you tackle them, mm -hmm. and the points you've given them. Mm -hmm. We were talking about bringing love back again in a marriage that is dying. If you follow these points, kissing, hugging. Talking, maybe the mongers may put up around 66 minutes. So, in short, if you just take an hour a day out of 24 hours that you are always very busy, just don't do your couple, Mwata Muzime, Sim, Muzime TV, just look at each other, admire God's work, hug, kiss. I think we'll be bringing a lot of strength in our marriages. Until next time, this is Naked, Naked and Not Ashamed Show.